This month, the American College of Emergency Physicians and EMS professionals all across America celebrate EMS Week. In Pinellas County, the Board of County Commissioners is proud to name this year's award-winning EMS professionals who best embody the theme of EMS Week 2013. One mission, one team. From St. Petersburg Fire Rescue, 11-year veteran firefighter EMT Jim Mativia is Pinellas County's EMT of the Year. Well, the mission of Pinellas County is, is that we provide an outstanding service. When you call us, we show up, we're professional, we take care of, we take care of the, the problem. We make sure that, that your patient care needs are met. From Sunstar to uh, Bay Flight to the medical director, um, to the outside agencies that we work with. Um, we do a lot of training together with each other and I think that's where um, things really come together is when everyone has the same, same idea of what's going on and everyone knows what's expected. I love this job, I wouldn't trade it for the world. A good day is knowing that you've, that you've saved someone's life. From Emergency Communications 911, Alexandra Dulce is Pinellas County Emergency Medical Dispatcher of the Year who helped bring baby Evan into the world in April of last year. Okay, is the baby crying or breathing? Is the baby crying or breathing? Okay. He's breathing. He's breathing? Now gently wipe off the baby's mouth and nose. Dry the baby off with a clean towel. I'm your towel, man. Give me the towel. Okay. Then wrap the baby in a clean, dry towel. Okay. Cover the baby's head, but not its face. Okay. Uh, congratulations. Uh, actually, that by far was one of my favorites. Um, because uh, even though it may be nerve-wracking to think that you're helping someone deliver a baby, it was actually exciting for me. <laughs> and I felt like I was part of that family, to tell you. I felt like a proud auntie <laughs> um, to be able to be part of that moment. And with every situation, you just have to know how to, to handle it. Um, and fortunately for me, I'm able to um, be a good listener and to process a call and, and get the person through what they're going through. Um, it's not to say that I'm not nervous at the time, um, but just being calm helps that person be calm as well. From Sunstar Paramedic Ambulance Service, 23-year EMS veteran Sean Tatum is Pinellas County's Paramedic of the Year. Uh, you never get used to possibly being the last one to hold somebody's hand. Uh, our job is to get that sick and injured patient back to the, uh, to the hospital where, the, where the other professionals can work on them and make sure that things go well. Um, and it doesn't matter if it's somebody that's choking to death, it's a life-saving measure, or just someone that just needs general help. You know, we're, we're here to work together. We're here to take care of people. Um, and I believe we do a very, very good job of that. It's not one person that, that makes a call or, or does care here in Pinellas. It's a, it's a team effort, and, and it's not just our team. It's, it's a team of uh, Sunstar, all the fire departments, the hospitals, nursing facilities, uh, medical, med other medical facilities that, uh, that call us and need us. I'm very proud of all the people and very happy to be part of the system. The Pinellas County Board of County Commissioners congratulates EMT of the Year Jim Mativia, Emergency Medical Dispatcher of the Year Alexandra Dulce, and Paramedic of the Year Sean Tatum, along with all the hardworking emergency service professionals that work within the Pinellas County EMS system. One mission, one team, Pinellas County EMS.